Friday night poetry at the Red Star Gallery. 2513 Volume Road, doors open at 9. Friday night poetry at the Red Star Gallery. Take it away, Bob. Hey, y'all, y'all. Good. Bonjour, y'all. A burn is classified with both the epidermal and doma layers of skin or charred by heat, leaving a leather like scar that requires reconstructive procedures. But no one ever told me how to reconstruct a butterfly with its rings burnt off before it ever emerged from its cocoon. I simply call her Auntie Mala. She reminds me of a decapitated angel, an example of what could happen if love taps go unchecked. Or what could happen if some men decide to love that woman to death like he, who thought that she was too pretty to leave, so he decided to make her to his trophy wife of ashes. Schizophrenic Michelangelo painted the 16th chapel of hell on her face with a lot of fluid and matches and roses stuffed in her mouth. How romantic. That's tango dance within the South, but she don't bust up her castle band family reunions. She just stands there wrapped in charred silk that made up of false promises that never quite metamorphosized from his caterpillar stage. Not knowing that one flap of her wings is similar to a hundred explosions of a phoenix. She never thought that when the fire on her body subsides, she would be withdrawn into this skin. That tiptoed off the side of her face, ran across her collarbone, and landed on her shoulder. Don't know what feels cold at the lips of strangers when she goes to the grocery store. The fact that she sleeps a little bit on that slap. With every skin grab, she receives these memories, bounce in gasoline so much so she shivers every time a family member with a cigarette gets too close. Because of love's road, pain with good intentions, and cancer spread through a kiss. And I wonder if he knows how to show affection towards a woman by watching his parents love like this. These love taps, these light licks, going serious to other day. My little cousin blushed while her mother told her about her kindergarten and questioned her in school, saying, baby girl, they hit you only when they like you. And she smiles. Reality cocoon something hideous. Like Auntie Ma, where she attempts to hide away from the sky, and now I'm tired. Or watching these licks of life ever turn to domestic homicide, tired. Or watching licks, bruised blue, hit by brand new Chanel shades, bought by Huffy because she couldn't love him. Pass the length of her money like a junkie. She's addicted, needing another hit or a hit. Because without it, she would surely become this fiend. And every time I see a battered woman, I smell gasoline. I think of my Auntie Ma when mm. I look at you. Skipping family reunions as she sits silent within the room. And I wonder if she knows the most beautiful 